Welcome everyone, in today's video I wanted to talk about Prism which is a new DEX aggregator live on Solana mainnet. So they spun off of uh, Symmetry Finance which is a um, index and DEX protocol itself. So Prism is sort of like part of that whole Symmetry Finance family. And they recently went live December 6th so I thought I might as well play around with it, talk to you guys about what I like, what I don't like and compare it to Jupiter Aggregator because I think this might be the sort of... Um, best competition that Jupiter has right now. So if we look onto Prism, it has a quite a nice user interface. I'm going to connect my wallet now. You have a good choice of wallets um, that you can use to connect to this. I'm just going to sign in with Phantom and we can see here, you know, it's it's a basic swap interface, very reminiscent of Jupiter Aggregator, just the way that it looks. So you can choose up here um, whatever token you want and then the bottom one, whatever you want to swap it to. So I've just got a USDC soul swap here and then it will give you um, all the different routes that you can take uh, to do this swap. So if I want to swap $200 worth of USDC into soul, uh, we've got like radium, serum, orca, all integrated here and it will give you the different routes. So USDC to soul here, free radium is currently the best route. Oh, it just switched to serum. And like I said, it, it's it's an aggregator. So it aggregates all of the top DEXs and it will choose the best one for you to get the best price. So they're currently not aggregating as much as Jupiter right now, but they've aggregated most of like uh, the major DEXs. So like Serum, Radium and Orca. And you can trade a lot of meme coins here as well. So uh, let's just say, for example, I wanted to trade Inu, <laughs> uh, Monster Inu, uh, Kishu Inu, all of these terrible scam meme coins you can trade through here as well so um, it aggregates all of the meme coin dexes and we have a couple of features here so if you click on this it will bring up just a chart of the sole usdc pair and then you can do 24 hours seven days 30 days six months and a year so if i change this let's make this ray see if the chart will change So this is pretty cool. Um, this actually allows you to chart uh, two non-stable coins against each other as well. If we go on the one year pair, we can see that Sol has massively outperformed Ray. Um, we can see that Sol has massively uh, outperformed Ray according to this chart. And if I change it, we should see the opposite where Ray is massively underperforming Sol. So this is really cool. Um, I don't think anyone else has this feature in like the whole of Solana DeFi. So I'm pretty happy about this and then if we go on to this arrow we have the top performers as well as the top losers so in the last 24 hours uh, Sabre has performed the best up 30% and the worst performing has been Invictus down 10% and then you can do the 30 day chart as well so Crown has been performing really well and Samo has been performing the worst down 74% so that's quite interesting so I like that we have this here and let's just do a swap to show you guys how it's done. So let's just do uh, USDC Sol. So if I just do $200 and then you can adjust the slippage in the settings. So I'm going to put it at 0.1% slippage and that should be enough because this is a very liquid pair. And then you can have this input percentage slider here as well. So if I turn that on, this will take whatever percentage I have of USDC in my wallet and then convert it into Sol. So if it was 50%, it would be this much. I can do like 75%, 65%. If you just wanted to convert like a, a percentage rather than manually type something in, then this is something that you can use. But let me just do 200 USDC into Sol. So we have uh, Serum being the best route currently. So I'll press swap. We have the transaction come up here and I'm just gonna press approve. Brilliant. Okay, so we've now done a swap and we had those fireworks come up, which I, I actually quite like that. It just makes the user experience nicer. So I'll swap that back as well. Let me just do one soul and I'll swap it back. So Serum is still the best route. Um, if we go down, there are other routes here as well. Like you could do soul to Ray to USDC, but it doesn't pay out as much as the just straight soul to USDC trade that we have through Serum. So I'll do that again. And lastly, I just wanted to do a comparison between uh, Jupiter Aggregator and Prism. 
and for the most part you're not really going to notice that much difference between the two it's only when you start trading large sums of money so for example 200,000 USDC to Sol it's going to get you about 1027 uh, so if you're trading through prism but on jupiter aggregator it gets you 1030 and that's you know like a 600 dollars difference roughly and it only you know as i said before you know you really tell the difference when you're trading like huge numbers like this so thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed this video and make sure to subscribe for more videos like this one